morning everyone. Yeah, I cut my hair, did it myself last night. It needed a good old chop, so I took about six inches off it. And it feels healthy and really nice and soft and no raggedy ends or anything like that. And of course I cut a fringe back in. So many of you said to me last time I did a fringe, oh, I really like you with a fringe, it really suits you, makes you look younger. Well, I'm not so sure about that, but I thought I'd give it a go again. So I just cut one in. Um, so yeah, it's just like this, just like a little, like that. But of course, me being me, I'm always pushing it off my face. So that's what it's that's what it's like. So I did it myself. I'm tucking it behind my ears because I stick my glasses on my head. And so it's just easier to do that. Um, well, I've got a lot of stuff to do today, I really have. Oh, I've got to go and pick up two dogs at 11 o'clock. Um, obviously bring them back here. Um, we've made the bed, we've, obviously I make the bed straight away, well, sometimes I air it, but, you know, make, generally make it straight away. Um, watered the orchids upstairs, watered some aloe vera plants I've got growing upstairs, watered vera at the bottom of the stairs. <laughs> I've got these plants here to do, and a load of tidying up, let me show you. Okay, so I've got these that I need to water. Washing up in the sink. I need to make a coffee. I've just done our um, our vitamin C drink. So I need to drink those in a minute. Um, I've got raspberries I've just taken out of the fridge. I need to use those. So I'm going to do some maybe pancakes and yogurt with raspberries. Um, I've had navel delivery, my lovely, so I need to go through that. And then over here, I've got washing to go away upstairs. And then a little shop, well, a shopping haul that we did. Uh, Chris was in need of a couple of t-shirts, so I went to Marx's because in, have you not cut yourself, have you? No. Oh. Oh, uh, oh I worried. Because when I saw you doing that, I worry when he cuts, if he cuts himself, because he's well, on blood. Well, well, no, yeah, yeah, well, because you're on blood thinners, aren't you? And, you know, yeah. I worry. Um, yeah, so Chris needed a couple of T-shirts, so I went to Marx's because you can get the nice length there for him. And, um, of course, they had the remaining bits of sale items, which I picked up, some of those. I'll show you those. Um, I went to Primark the other day with Hannah picked up a few basic summer bits there and when we went to Sainsbury's I saw this lovely blouse how pretty is this blouse um, and that was £4.80 so I know I've been spending but it was worth it um, and then I need to sort out all my drinks sort out this uh, unit the the dresser it's like turned into a bit of a dumping ground so it needs sorting I'll do that today once I've got the dogs. I need to hoover but I'm doing all the jobs first. And then in here, da, da, da. so Chris has finished the mantelpiece. How lovely, I absolutely adore it. I love it, it just looks so, so nice, doesn't it? Um, so I think he's just, he's uh, done the end now. And then he's got to stay, um, I think he wants to put another coat of stain on that. And then some varnish. Um, we need to dust it now, because obviously he's been working here and it's got a bit dusty. Um, Hoover all ran there by the telly and dust it and moved the TV back sort of that way a bit more. Um, I've got, look at all the dust on here from all that work. Oh, wow. So I've got the cloth that was on here in the wash. I've got a white wash on. And I'm hoping to get it on the line today. So yeah, all in all, my lovelies, it's like a bit of a little bit of a shithole today. <laughs> and it needs some work doing so. Yeah, priority is another coffee, going to get the dogs, and then back for something to eat, I think. Say hi Chris. Hi Chris. <laughs> what are you 
doing out there, Mrs? Miss Olive? You could do with a haircut, I think. Yes, you could. Your daddy needs to groom you. Yes. Bess? Hello, Baba. Hello, baby. So both of these little dogs have been rescued from, I think it's Romania, both of them actually. Both of them definitely rescue. Aren't they cute? You and your holly, holly, holly bobs. Only for a day. Well, overnight. <laughs>
So Luke and Chris went off to Hung Bargains, got these great big tubs here, um, and they, well, I think Luke picked up these, didn't you? Mm -hmm. Oh, you also nipped into M&S, Marks and Spencers. Um, so, a couple of these, I don't even know what they're for. What are they for? What did you buy these for? What did you buy for? We don't know. Um, I honestly ca cannot remember what he bought these for, but there's two grey ones here, um, and I can't even, I don't even know how much they were actually. There might be a receipt in there. Um, okay, so I'm just gonna pull the stuff out. Righty ho, so, did you, there's two packs of these mom like things, aren't there? There's two packs of Yeah. So for Marks and Spencers, they've got two packs of these. We actually have eaten a pack already. And these are the, um, they're cheese hot cross buns with Marmite. They are beautiful. There isn't any fruit in there. So if you think, oh God, that's gonna be horrible with like a fruit hot cross bun with Marmite. Um, I actually think it'd be quite nice, but there isn't any fruit in here at all. And they're very, they are very cheesy marmite here, that's all I can say. And if you toast them as well, put them under the grill, they taste even more sort of cheesy marmite, but they are delicious, absolutely delicious. And does it say limited edition? I'm sure it did. So I think they only bring these out, yeah, sort of Easter time. So I'm gonna go, we're gonna go up to Marx's and, uh, stock up and freeze them because we like them that much. Um, okay, now I've got to be very careful how I show these because she's already seen them, my little dog. Um, but do pick them up here. <laughs> Three packs of tennis balls. Now around this house somewhere and in the garden, we must have a hundred million tennis balls, but we can't find them. So, no, you can't have them yet. You can't have them yet. No, you can't. What I do is I'll give them a treat and then she'll forget about it for a bit. Um, we've got these. Oh, they picked up these biscuits. This is the biscuit selection. Um, 800 grams in here. Again, I'm not sure on the prices of this. So it wasn't there. Um, but this we got for a... 109. 109, is it? Oh, about 109, Luke said. Um, but these are for a dog. Do you remember Frankie, the dog that's blind? Um, he can't eat certain things. He can't eat because it upsets his tummy, but he's allowed these biscuits. Um, so, got those for him. No, you can't have it, Elsie. I'll give you a treat. I'm going to give them one. I'm going to give them one of these just to sort of so they're quiet. Um, so, these are the uh, meaty chewy duck fillets. How much are these? These must have been quite expensive. They're about three. About three fifty or something. Oh well, that's not bad, is it? Quite a lot in there. Under four pounds. Under four pounds. Yeah. Oh well, that's not too bad, is it? Um, and they are a hundred. I'll see. Stop growling. Hundred percent natural duck breast meat. Um, grain free, low in fat, and high in protein. So brilliant. So I'm just going to give them all one of these, and she might forget about rules. But look, that's what they look like. They absolutely love them. And then I'll just show you these. Luke picked up these, the, uh, the schmackos. These are fish flavour. And, um, oh, they're both fish flavours. So two packs of those, so 20, 20 in a packet of fish flavour. And then last but not least, uh, Luke picked up another sloth for Teddy. Both Elsie and Teddy have got sloths, but one of the, well, they're starting to see better days. And uh, a sloth is, ooh, wow. Teddy's favourite toy. He absolutely loves the sloth. Um, he 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 does this to it. He like sucks it. So if he's like feeding from his mum, and he'll do this. If I can find a video, I will include it in here so you can see what he does with it. So yeah, he's got a new one.
Lately, my thoughts got me distant. Darker days filling up darker minds. Stuck in this room that keeps spinning. Wondering how you been, where you hide. Late night drinking, wishful thinking. What? 